before we go any further and, and start watching this video that's hopefully going to give everybody a hoot, um, I want to let everybody know that we, we've talked about a, a show that OVW did several months back. I can't remember when it was now. To uh, As a fundraiser for Matt Capitelli, he got another round of uh, newspaper and news interviews as the, as the local TV stations here were covering his battle with cancer, which started here, what, 10, 12 years ago. Um, he originally was diagnosed with a, you know, the brain tumor and had that removed, went through the treatment and had even been, been back in recent years, uh, training one of the amateur classes at OVW. And then it came back and, and it was reported a lot in the news. They, they did set up a GoFundMe at the time and we plugged it, but we will talk about that again. But at this point it's been reported, um, on the internet and and I'm pretty sure they're going to be doing a follow-up story on the news here that they've decided to discontinue his treatment um because apparently there's not really much else that they can do and it was starting to be a point where it was counterproductive is is you know all I really know right now but so there is a GoFundMe set up and it's it's GoFundMe slash Matt's biggest battle and you know this was a kid that if this had not happened and, and we talked about it in a way that he had a lucky break when, when he got knocked out is how they originally diagnosed the original problem, but he was just not moments, but on the verge of debuting on the main roster, he was pretty much everybody thought of all the tough enough guys, him and John Morris and John Hennigan, you know, we're going to be the stars. And, and, uh, and actually I think Matt got the wrestling business, part of it better than than john did so anyway um but the, it looks like uh, the the gofundme it's not a I, I checked it out myself uh it's one of those ones that's been up on an ongoing basis because the, it, it, i think they've had it up for six or seven months or whatever but it's a continuing situation because i can't imagine what kind of bills and problems that they have gone through to this point and and will continue to so at any rate uh, if you go to GoFundMe, just look for Matt Capitelli or Matt's Biggest Battle. It's 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 there. It won't be hard to find. And and you know, for anybody that uh, that was enjoyed what he did uh, in OVW and and just have has followed it because he's been you know so tough about this. Has followed his story until then, and he's been more inspirational in his real life fight than he, you know, than anything he had the chance to do in the ring. So I just wanted to mention that to everybody and we wish Matt the best. And, and his, his wife is the one who made the post. And, but, uh, I, I, as a matter of fact, and uh, I guess I'm not telling any tales out of school, but Johnny Jeter, uh, is in town this week in Louisville visiting some friends. And he mentioned, well, I'm trying to hook up with him, but he mentioned that he's going to drop by and see Matt. So a bunch of his, Friends, I think uh, uh, Cliff Compton Domino was uh, was over there the other day. Anyway, we wish everybody the best.